What's going on, dickweeds? Kentucky Fried Chicken, eh? Fucking rights. French fries and gravy, popcorn chicken. I got a macaroni salad right there. We got a couple greasy pieces of chicken right there. We'll save them till later because, well, yeah, they kind of, they're too greasy right now, eh? You think they're too greasy right now, Donna? They're yuck. <laughs> Donna's got the same thing over there. Except she doesn't like the macaroni salad. I don't like any of their salads from there. She's on the water. I forgot to grab a drink. Fuck! Hey! Uh, I'll have to get something. Uh, so yeah, we're having Kentucky Fried Chicken. KFC. Do they call it Kentucky Fried Chicken anymore, Donna? I don't know. Well, it says KFC. KFC. <laughs> Anyway, uh, I got some Ghost Train Haze loaded up right there. It's really good. Gives you the munchies. And yeah. Anything to say, Donna? No. No. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put you cocksuckers on the counter. Look at all that. Look at all the gravy. I, I went to show you guys last time we had this. They give you a small little thing of fries. Look at that. Well, there's probably... I probably should have less fries. Donna gave me most of hers because she's a little bit fucked in the head. Eh? And look at that. They give you a little thing of fries and this great big jumbo-sized thing of gravy. And there's so much left still. Like, fuck. I don't know why they give you so much, but I guess it's better than not having enough. Eh? Just touching that thing got... My fingers all fucked, cocksucker. Okay, uh, Donna, I can see your coochie under the table. Oh, you can. <laughs> Feel like you're in the middle? No. 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 Perfect. Do you need anything before I sit down, other than paper towel? Mm, no. No. These paper towels, there's a couple from the Kentucky Fried Chicken, but they're usually pretty greasy. It's like, you go to wipe your face off and you just put nothing but grease on the fucking thing. <laughs> it's like that, uh, McDonald's is probably the fucking worst. Yeah. The fucking bad. paper towels at McDonald's are drenched in grease. Dirty cock suckers. Hey. You guys might be wondering why we're eating KFC when we're on a diet. Well, I'll tell you why. Today's the welfare day. And in our neighborhood, all the people that are on welfare have been ordering skip the dishes all day long. So we've been watching fast food go this way and that way and this way and that way and back to this house and back to this house. Some people have ordered three or four times already. And we're sitting there thinking, well, fuck! You know, we're getting hungry and hungry and stomach's growling and we figure, fuck it. Let's get some KFC. We want to eat like the people on the welfare too, eh? Fuck's sakes. I'm not even kidding. Skip the Dishes is running all over the fucking place today. There's East Indians everywhere. <laughs> eh? Well, it's true. <laughs> so, what do you want to talk about today, Don? Um.
yesterday's show when we were talking about uh, the toilet paper. Yeah, COVID. in Oshawa, whatever. Yeah, they sold out of toilet paper in Oshawa. I showed you guys a picture yesterday that was on the well on on the online news. When I was out yesterday, I like I wasn't on every single store with it, but then I found out after the show was over that stores were starting to sell out of the toilet paper, especially like the club packs and Walmart already has like they put a limit of two, like only two packs per per family. So I actually went to Food Basics. It's not like we didn't have toilet paper. I just wanted to just have the extra one just in case. Because <laughs> you don't want those gigantic fuckers. Mm -hmm. Because there was barely any toilet paper at the store. I was like, she got a pack of toilet paper that comes with a bunch of packs of toilet paper inside, eh? The club packs, because I was like, I went down the aisle and I'll tell you, I was a little bit disappointed, but I didn't see those club packs at first. I was like, fuck, like, I'll just have to get this one. And then at the end of the aisle, I seen them, so I kind of walked quickly, grabbed one, grabbed, they had a lot of paper towel, but, um, anyways. They won't for very long. So, I guess. Some the, people haven't caught on yet that we're in the second wave of COVID, and as soon as they do. They're gonna go and oh, yeah. probably charge up their credit card over there and Well, right now, okay this Or is should I say credit cards? I'll, eh? go, I'll go back to what I was gonna say. Well the government today said I think it's by October there or what was it? Sometime October in October that it's gonna be like we're gonna see a thousand cases a day of COVID. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like the government's gonna start making people sick on purpose, eh? No. Because I don't think COVID's real. I saw, I read that today and I was like, there's no fucking way, like. And then people are starting to say, well, like, what was the point of fucking putting the mask in? If there's gonna be a thousand cases a day. Yeah, what's the point of the mask? What's the point of anything? Mm hmm. No. Back to Food Basic Story. I came around the corner after getting the at the big club pack of toilet paper here, right? And I'm walking. Well, this fucking lady. What? I don't think you had that big club pack down there. It's almost as tall as you. You would have had it up here. No, I can't have to carry. She would have carried it like this. Kind of like that, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, there was this fucking lady there. Twenty fucking. Containers of Lysol wipes. I counted them in the fucking cart because she was going that slow and she was like just kind of like smiling. What the hell could somebody need 20 containers of Lysol wipe for? I don't fucking know, but she had 20 of them in her fucking cart and she was just like smiling away like she was like, you know, the shit because she fucking <laughs> had all the Lysol wipes. <laughs> huh. And that's all I know about that. Well, all right then. Yeah, I have not for notes. Today's Wednesday. It's hump day. We had a lot of banging. And watching all the skip the dishes stuff happening, our stomach started growling and we broke down and got some fast food. <laughs> Fuck! Eh? But, yeah, I don't know what else to say. Welfare. It's fast food day here in our neighborhood. Well, it is. Welfare day is fast food day. As soon as... Well, it's true, right? Let them know. You see the same thing as me. I see a lot of skip the dishes. That's all you see around here on welfare day is skip the dishes. I didn't know you can get a welfare check just to get fast food. Had I known all along, <laughs> we'd be on the welfare, Donna. <laughs> They eat good on welfare. Some of those cocksuckers are, they have two or three different orders going to their house. KFC, McDonald's, Subway. Fuck! It's true. Fuck, last night I was checking Donna's surveillance camera. I was going through like, cause she pays for like the, uh, what do you call it? Where they save your videos? Um, 
They have a name for it. The subscription, I guess. The subscription. Okay, well, anyway, she pays for a subscription that's called The Subscription. <laughs> and all her videos get saved, everything that records. And even when the camera's not on, it takes a bunch of stills. How, how often do the stills get taken? Uh, every, you, every, no, not every, every hour or something like that. Or something. Yeah, so if you guys have a ring camera, you already know what I'm talking about. Well, we got two of them outside, one facing up Maple North and one facing up that way on Bruso. Anyway, I was looking through the stuff last night, all the months of stuff we have on there so far, and you wouldn't believe all the skip the dishes that show up here on the first of the month. They get really busy over here. And you also wouldn't believe all the people ripping off the government around here. I didn't realize how many people were living around here that don't really live around here until I looked at the camera last night. Fuck! Hey? Eh? A lot of fraud happening here in Timmins, Ontario. Just saying. Not my business, but my surveillance camera doesn't lie. It even shows people living around here. Don't, did I say that already? What did I say? Um, Fuck! Um, hey, I, I don't, was, I don't I even know what I said. I was listening, I just don't remember. Oh yeah, people, there's people that live in these units here that don't live in these units here. But you wouldn't notice unless you really paid attention, I guess. I was checking out the security camera last night and Hey, eh? I'm fucking telling you. Anyway, enough about the welfare fraud and stuff. There's a lot of welfare fraud happening around here, though. People living around here that don't live around here and stuff. Sorry about the boring video. Not much happened today. Woke up. Scrubbed the old meat cigarette. Looked out the window. I was wondering why there's East Indians everywhere. I thought we were getting invaded or something. And then I realized it's welfare day. Eh? They're all walking around with those fucking fast food suitcases. And then they would leave, and then they'd come back, then they'd leave, and then they'd come back. Another, fuck, there'd be like three or four of them on the street at one time. There's one family up the street, I won't mention any names or nothing. They had skipped the dishes for breakfast, lunch, and supper so far. I wish I had that. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of fast food. That's a lot of fast food, but probably tastes really good, eh? Yeah. Especially when you got the munchies. I get the munchies from weeds all the time. Anyway, speaking of weeds, I gotta get in a bomb toke. Eh? What do you wanna talk about? I, I don't know. Let's talk about, let's keep it the same, the theme the same. Let's talk about welfare day here in Timmins, Ontario. Eh? I don't know if it was had to, anything to do with welfare day or if it was just like, because you don't know anymore, but I had uh, an appointment I had to go to uh, this morning, and there was th this couple, I, or maybe they were just friends. Anyways, I don't know what the fuck that they were on. Something that makes you just, when you're standing there, you just, they needed to move. That's better, eh? Fucking right. I don't know what drug that is, but anyways, they were on whatever that is, okay? So, instead of waiting for the fucking, uh, the little man to show up there to walk across, like, the walk sign yeah, thing yeah. there. Yeah. This is on Algonquin. It's fucking busy on Algonquin in the morning. For those of you that aren't from Timmins or never been here, Algonquin's the main busy road that goes right through town. Yeah, it goes, you just 
Anyways, so they start fucking running, okay? And the girl was not like athletic build. <laughs> There's a lot of that around here. And it was like she Especially was, on our street with all the skip the dishes. <laughs> she's like, you know Oh for fuck's sakes. Mother I fucking knew it! I was like, oh well you're gonna try this today. This is gonna fucking work. I dropped a French fry on Donna with gravy on Donna's mat. It hasn't even been on the table for, for 24 fucking hours yet. <laughs> oh, oh Looks like you gotta wash it again, Donna. Well, I guess so. <laughs> Fuck, Eddie! How did I know? So the lead, the one girl gets across, right, to the... She has to actually stop on the little island there, you know, where the fucking... <laughs> Take a breath? No, because the cars were fucking... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so the guy's, like, right behind, look, but as, like, she's more moving, you know, surprisingly quicker than the guy, and the guy was, like, thin. So he gets on the thing, right? And they're like, cars are fucking just whizzing by, right? And they're just standing there. And like, you can tell, like, they need to just keep moving because she starts going like this, right? And <laughs> <laughs> oh, from the drugs? Yeah. The that, yeah. They're just like, she's just going, like, she's just standing there. and She started to like, tweak out. Is that what's called tweaking? She was tweaking. <laughs> she keeps looking over at the guy, right? And then they're smiling at each other. And I was like, fuck, like... So anyways, they did make it across the street, but then, uh, where did I go? Oh, I had to drive Justin somewhere. Those fucking cocksuckers, I don't know where they went this morning, but they were down, like, Algonquin area. I drove Justin, and they were always, they were coming back down fucking Riverside. Ooh. The same fucking junkies just fucking oh. going the fucking smiling. So <laughs> <laughs> all you see around here is fucking junkies. And they probably got their welfare checks today, too. That's probably why you seen them in the street. Well, they were happy as fuck, I'm telling you. They, I, but I will say, there was actually a lot of people, like, I had to, my appointment was... Have a chicken, Donna. No. I, <laughs> I was downtown, my appointment was downtown, and uh, you, uh, you really don't feel safe down there. It, there was, like... You went downtown on welfare day. You got every fucking type of person out today, Donna. You got the root. Not <laughs> that. Okay, maybe this person wasn't on welfare, so I shouldn't say that. But this fucking lady, I had to walk by the past the bank to uh, where I was going, right? Mm -hmm. She's standing there with a dirty fucking cigarette, right? <laughs> and there's a guy, a bigger man, older man, in a wheelchair. Do you think she'd fucking move? And she's standing there and she's fucking moving her, like, you know, when those women fucking start going like that with their... <laughs> she's fucking, like, in the fucking dirty cigarette smokes all. And she's seen me coming, whatever. She wouldn't fucking move. I had to, you know, make, like, uh, do, like, a yeah, where side. Where Right down st at the bank, at TD fucking bank. Huh. Yeah, well, bad day to go to the bank, Donna. No, I didn't go to the bank. Oh. I had to pass the bank because right beside the bank is where I have to go. I was going to say, it's a bad day to go to the bank when everybody on welfare is there. As I was walking... People on welfare are some of the rudest cocksuckers you'll ever meet. In this town, anyways. <laughs> yeah. They are, they're rude. I don't know. But I just... I don't like going down. <laughs> I don't like going down there at all. Because there was, there was people sleeping... You know when you go into Royal Bank, not on the side where the bank is, but the other way? Yeah. There was people all camped out in there this morning. Yeah, well, in our neighborhood, on Welfare Day today, most people were dressed up like they were going to church, eh? <laughs> it was weird. You don't see any of these people ever dressed up, but today, <laughs> they had their best on. <laughs> It's true. I, <laughs> I know people don't like to hear it, but that's what I'm seeing. Like, I can't help it. That's what I see. I can't pretend I didn't see that. I see it on every welfare day. I don't know. I don't, uh... I, I didn't really, uh... Fuck, I got up this morning because one of those fuckers across the street that are on welfare had to have their car warmed up and ready to go first thing. 
Yeah, you fucking loud cock sucker. You fucking, I woke up. I was already getting out of bed, but I still heard you, you fucking, you I heard fucking like slam dick. of a door, and I'm like, what the fuck is that? I get up, I'm like, oh, you, you fucking dirty cock sucker. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that was good. Thanks for a paper towel, Donna. Anytime, Ed. Fucking right. We had um, our granddaughter. Yep. Over today. Oh, well, yeah, I forgot to mention that. We babysat Haley today. We we're supposed to babysit Dustin, too, but he didn't want to stay. He wanted to go with his dad, so Michael took him shopping, and Haley's coming around here, and. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she kept us busy. Yes. <laughs> really busy. Very, very busy. Well, I, well, I didn't want it to, you know, stick out. The gravy's pretty watery today. Ew. You see that? Watch. Uh. <laughs> it's all water. It didn't taste very good either, but you know, I was hungry. Watching all the fast food today, I just can't help it. <laughs> Fucking chaos. So I guess we're back on the diet now? Yeah. <laughs> the fun's over? Yeah. Fuck! I should lick the. Don't! That's fucking <laughs> gross. It shouldn't look like that. No, I know, but that's. I don't know if you guys can see or not, but. Ew. Okay, stop doing it. It looks like runny poo. Stop. <laughs> runny poo. <laughs> Donna. If that's what your shit looks like. No, but it just looks disgusting. Yeah, I got no notes. We're smoking Ghost Train Haze from Kootenai Botanicals. Did I mention that? I'm smoking Darth Vader OG. Also from Kootenai Botanicals. Both very good strains. One's a sativa and the other's an indica. If anybody gives a fuck, you probably don't. Uh, I'm just coming to clean out my bowl so I can fill it back up. Got to keep a full bowl. And, uh, what do you want to talk about, Donna? We've got a few more minutes left here. Uh, I'm, I'm... Grizzly Dan said he got his package today. Oh, yay. Good for you. <laughs> we're glad it made it to you. Yeah, we're glad Canada Post didn't steal it. Or anybody else. Where do you live? Because I know I I know that it's bad there for people people stealing out of mailboxes. For the soup? Yeah, there's a lot like yeah, there's a lot of thieves up that way. So I'm glad that it uh, we got it. I was born in Sault Ste. Marie. I think I told you guys that before a couple times. Not like the Sioux. You don't like the Sioux. I. It's not uh, the place for me. Uh, you got to be able to take it down to street level living over there, Donna. Yeah, well, I can't <laughs> take it down to street level. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, if you can't take it down to street level, you shouldn't be in the Sioux. You don't belong there if you can't, if you can't, yeah, eh? It seems like a rough, like it's a rough town, like a city, like it's just rough. Well, it depends who you are and who you know and what you do and how you live your life and... That kind of shit, eh? I I think though the people that live there, all, even though it, they could be like the nicest people here and they don't get into trouble, but I think because you, like you, like you could tell that you're from the Sioux. I don't think you could tell that I'm like, from the Sioux. Like how you act, you could you you can I don't know I find Sioux people are like they can do everything, whatever, but they always have that fucking roughness in them, you know, like if you said, you know, fuck you, then you, you know, Sally and Pat across the street, you know, the nice couple are gonna be like, fuck you too, and you know, <laughs> grab a bat or something. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Do you understand any of that, Grizzly Dan? <laughs> I don't think it's that bad down there. <laughs> I'm telling, I'm like, I'm telling you, I see this stuff all the time, and it's like... Well, you're, re you're reading the fucking stuff on the Facebook and stuff, though. And the pictures. A lot of that stuff's exaggerated, I think. Uh, no, not when people are showing people taking packages out of the mailbox. 
Well, are sitting in the middle of the street high on fucking whatever, and bikes <laughs> gone missing, and somebody fucking picked up a note or something, and it was like, you know, get, like a list of shit to get, whatever. <laughs> like, a list of things to steal? Yeah, like, it was like, <laughs> it was like tool, and somebody said it was like, it's probably for their drug dealer, so they, they get them whatever drugs, but it was like, any, like, there was a company name, any one of those tools, you know, three measuring fucking tapes. <laughs> well, so people need stuff to go to work. And sometimes some people know how to get it cheap. Apparently. Five finger discount, eh? <laughs> so, yeah. It, it, no, seriously, some people need, need some startup shit for work and it's hard to come by. So you write a list of the tools you need and some people know where to get them, right? Apparently in everybody's porch and shed. <laughs> Porches and sheds, yeah, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> I haven't been to the zoo in a while, so I don't know. Maybe it's changed. Maybe. <laughs> My dad goes down there like, fuck, once a week, for fuck's sakes. And, and, he, and last he never said nothing about it being all fucked, did he? Yes, the last time we seen him, he said it's bad. <laughs> oh, I, don't, I, didn't, I guess I wasn't listening. I didn't know. This stuff still looks greasy. It looks just fucking like... It looks soaked in grease. It's been sitting there forever, and I don't know if you guys could tell, but... It's... it's look at look at the fucking stains of grease. I don't even know if there's any meat in there. I don't think so. That's the ones that don't have meat. It's just all bone and skin. And they cake it in flour and fucking fry it up to make it look puffy. <clears throat> That's what it looks like. It looks like somebody already ate the chicken, and then, and then they Kentucky fried the bone, eh? That stinks, eh? Can you really, you pick that up and wave it on smell. Take a flip. Yeah, it has a stink to it. Hey, Donna. Fuck off, Eddie. You remember Donna's story from the other day? Some kids used to tease her when she was younger or something, or somebody called, what did, somebody called you drumstick legs. In high school. So here's what Donna's legs look like. <laughs> here's Donna walking around. Eddie, put the fucking bag! Give <laughs> me one of those. <laughs> they don't look like that. The fuck? That just makes me sad. <laughs> if you guys missed that video, you gotta go back. I don't know what it's called, but Donna told the story about some... Somebody who called her drumstick legs and then some other stories about other names she was called and <laughs> I seen those two legs right there and I couldn't help myself. <laughs> they don't look like guys. <laughs> I didn't say they did, but that's what you I know, but you're like you said in your story. Real <laughs> fucking slow. <laughs> Cause I feel like it's so meaty that I can't fucking watch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, come on. What? Anything, any last things before we fuck off over here? No, I don't have anything now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sorry about the boring video. Nothing really happened today. It's really boring around here. It's Wednesday, hump day. We banged a lot, but then we had to babysit. And then we watched a lot of fast food get delivered around here because it's the welfare day <laughs> here. And well, I was going to say Timmins, but I guess all around Canada, probably, or Ontario anyways. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, all the, all the welfare recipients were getting fast food, so we decided we were going to do that too. Because we were hungry. And now, I wish I would have kept my money. <laughs> I know. Well, it wouldn't do bad. All this only costs 10 bucks. Yeah, but... I don't know. The gravy's all fucking watery, so that's like... You should discount it. That's gross. It looks... Yeah. Okay, stop doing that. You're going to make me sick. Drink it for the video. No! You know what I should do? I should put on my GoPro head up to the welfare office and apply for a welfare check for fast food and bring you guys along. 
I should go in there and say, how do I get a check so I can get fast food on the first of every month? You can't go in there yet. You can't go in there yet? No. Oh, because COVID. Yeah, fucking COVID. Well, when COVID's over, I'm going to bring you guys in there and see what they say. <laughs> they might tell me to get the fuck out of there. I, they probably... They might call the police. I don't know. But... Everybody else that's on welfare, they use their welfare checks to get food, like from the fast food joints, and I just figured, well, maybe I'm eligible for a few Big Macs, eh? <laughs> Fucking right. Imagine that. Imagine they said that. I'll give you enough money, Mr. Dampier, so that you can get yourself five Big Mac combos on the first of every month. <laughs> I hope. Is that how it works? I don't think so. Well, how the fuck do these people get all that stuff? I don't know. Get what? If you know, leave a comment down below. How do you go about getting welfare to buy fast food every month? No, you know what could be some of it? Because that rule came into effect, remember, uh, I don't know how many years ago, uh, maybe at least three years ago. You know yourself. When right. Remember, um... What do I know? You had heard those girls talking that day? Um, coming out of the you you had to go up to housing for something remember in the elevator those girls were talking about how much money they're gonna have because welfare can't take fucking like, oh yeah custody uh, yeah yeah you know? that's true that did happen that was like uh last year last summer i don't know when it was yeah i was up i was up at the uh timmins housing and the timmins housing and the welfare office are like the same fucking on the same exact floor they might even be the same people i don't fucking know Anyway, um, there were some girls in the elevator. We went down together in the elevator, and the girls were just fucking excited about how much money they were going to score off of uh, their ex-boyfriends for, uh, what's it called again? Because child support. Child support and how welfare can't take it away from them anymore because yeah. there's a new rule or something. Yeah. yeah, that's what I heard them say. Something. Is that true, though? Yeah. So it is true. So, like, yeah, say if you're getting, like, say if uh, you have your welfare check and... Say your the father of the kid was giving you four hundred dollars, say a month. Well, welfare used to dock half of it or whatever it was, cause but they took that out. So now, so say if so, that's why there's so much skip the fucking dishes. So you get your welfare. That explains it. Okay. Eh? Plus your child support payments on top of that, and they can't do anything. They they don't touch. Just a bunch of greedy women. So like if you know. And plus they give you, like, so say if there's a mom with, you know, four kids with four different dads and she gets... That's it. It's just a bunch of greedy women. Yeah. it's. it's and you guys, some of you are probably saying, well, how are they greedy women? Blah, blah, blah. Well, if you're getting child support and welfare, you shouldn't be ordering to skip the dishes three fucking times for yourself. Most of these people's kids are at school today and they're just filling their own fucking heads. <laughs> Well, that's sad. You, you know, you need to... Yeah. So think about that. I think the jizz is doing something. Oh. Um, anyway, I think that's all we got. Yeah. I don't feel like talking about the welfare anymore. Uh, I feel like I should take a video of that and send it to head office. Maybe you should. How about that? Maybe send it to them and say, the Why fuck? is the gravy so fucking watery? And then you guys will watch a video next week and Donna will have coupons. I don't want, I don't want the coupons. <laughs> coupons for free gravy from KFC. No, they can keep it. It's good. <laughs> <coughs> okay, well, anyway. Uh, you have anything else to say? No. I thought I had one more thing to say before I left. Hey, I don't remember. Cocksucker, I hate when that fucking happens. I just don't remember. If I remember, I'll tell you guys tomorrow. Whatever it was. Or whatever I was going to say. Or something. If mm -hmm. there was something. I don't really remember. Or was there something? I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure now either. I thought I had something. Anyway. Uh... We're at the end? You got nothing else to say? No. Okay, well, uh...
this fucking road. <laughs> Donna, you shouldn't do that at the Eddie. table. Okay, we're gonna fuck off out of here. It's like it's spinning. I'm gonna get in my road toke. Somebody's in the driveway. I'm gonna get in my road toke. Donna's gonna get in her final words. And come on, final words, Donna. Don't worry about the um, driveway. Stay happy and stay safe. Uh, be kind. Enjoy Wednesday or what's left of it. Don't order from KFC. And, uh,. Yeah. And if you're on the welfare and you're ordering to skip the dishes, share the food with your kids. Don't be so cheap. Yeah. You don't buy the food before they get home from school three fucking times. Fuck! Hey, eh? Who does that? I don't know, but he... Our neighbors do. The whole fucking block. Well, not all of them, but... Lots. You know who you are. Lots do. I wish I could start all over, have five kids and get a welfare check and when they're at school on the welfare day, I would sample all the city's fast food by myself. That's a lot of money. <laughs> That's a lot of money, I know. <laughs> but... Way she goes. Way she fucking goes. <laughs> okay, we're gonna fuck off out of here. Smoke some more weeds. Maybe try this, but probably not. Smoke some more weeds. Look for something else to munch on. Smoke some more weeds. Watch some YouTube videos. And, um... Keep on smoking weeds. <laughs> so until tomorrow, like. Subscribe. And fuck off. Hey!